just that I had to hop on here and do some control. Yeah, because I've been wanting to and I've been promising it for a while. Don't want to disappoint you guys. Just getting the volume set right there. What up? I don't know if anybody else is streaming right now or if Dimash is planning on streaming when he gets home. This might be a short stream. Who knows? But I figured because, you know, the painting stream didn't work out today, it would be fun to start this. So, welcome to you guys joining me. Uh, smash the like button. That'd be awesome. And let's jump into it. That's my dryer in the background, if you can hear it. What's up, Meow Meow 10 and Robo Ninja? Guys, this game is kind of spooky, so you know. Also, I know it's late for some of you. Spooks. You look so gorgeous. Hey, thanks, Robo. Appreciate it. Maddie, what's up, Moose? Thanks for coming by, guys. We're going to do a new game here. This will overwrite all your previous progress. <sighs> you know what? I'm okay with that. Because I started the game so that I wouldn't like make a fool of myself uh, playing it for the first time in front of you guys. Um, but we're just going to go back to the beginning so we can enjoy the story. <coughs> meow, meow. Heart, 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 so many hearts. Uh, oh, are you guys scared? I'm scared already. You get PC in slobs sorted. You know, Moose, technology sometimes stresses me out so much I have to just walk away. So I have not yet done it. Uh, I had to walk away. I will. I will. Yeah, I will. <laughs> um, we've got to give Mary. my. I made a profile on the PC. This is going to be. Got to give it admin permissions. Usual. Can't be helped. You called me. So here I am. Who called who? You called me? I called you? I know I shut you out sometimes. <laughs> I'm always glad to hear from you. It's just that I get my hopes up. So many times it's led to nothing. I found nothing. It's like we live in a room. And there's a poster on the wall. We stare at it and we think that's the whole world. Federal Bureau of Control. The room. And the poster. The picture's something nice. A landscape, a famous person. Like in that movie. What is it called? The prison movie. movie. Oh yeah, the prison movie. The room's a cell, and the picture, it's different for each of us. It can be beautiful or terrible, but we're all transfixed. Ah! Oh my god. But it's all a lie. Something to distract us from the truth. They're lying to us. We're lying uh. to ourselves. Scary the man. Is not the world. The world. This guy scares me the most. The guy who's like cleaning. Much stranger. There's a hole hidden behind that poster that leads to the real world. We all feel safe in that room. But sometimes, sometimes something crawls out from behind the poster. Ah! And the ones that see it happen freak out and try to forget what they saw. Yeah, like that video. I'm here. Steve sent me a scary video the other day. Why did you bring me here? 
one of those jump scare videos, you know? Hello? And the jump scare involved a Anyone spider. Here? Even after, like, I threw my phone and screamed and whatever, I, like, an hour later felt like there was a spider in my house. <laughs> that never really was a spider. That It was just on my phone. <sighs> but it's terrible. I hated it. This is suitably scary. Nice suitably scary intro. Robo says, Arnold, do it. Do it now. If Tom was here. Yeah, he's not. He's probably asleep. Maybe. Hopefully. That guy needs some rest. Hello? Move. Just camera. Okay, we got it. Typewriter. It's a very tidy desk. Look at all the people out here. This place? It's pretty dirty. New York, maybe? All right. Nobody's here. Just walk right in. What is this? Reminder, certain objects are not allowed inside the Bureau. Recent incidents have necessitated an issued reminder on prohibited materials. Unauthorized weapons, pagers, laptops, smart watches, smart phones, smart gaming devices, anything smart. Number two pencils, any objects considered iconic representations of an archetypal concept, e.g. rubber ducks, ketchup bottles. Hmm. All material under bureau investigation is to be brought in through the private entrances. If you see any lobby personnel in breach of these policies, please notify your supervisor immediately. Alrighty. there. The stairs, maybe? Mm. Ooh. What's going on here? <gasps> Godfrey! God, look, guys. God, do you see Godfrey? There he is. He's on the back of my chair. Godfrey. Look at the camera. Will the camera pick him up? There he is! <laughs> That's Godfrey! Oh, buddy. He likes to climb up there on the back of my chair. That's going to be really terrifying <laughs> during this game. Ah, Godfrey, get your butt out of my face. Get your butt out of my face. Hey. Mister. Is your phone okay? <laughs> oh yeah, it's mm, no worse than it already was. Um, I have this game still in the Xbox. The Ultimate was one of the PS Plus games. Morning all, Galrick, what's up? Welcome, hi. Maddie, you and Dimash should do a studio tour. Would love to see your setup. Oh. You know what? When the setup is set up, we will. <laughs> We're s it's still very, like, MacGyver-esque right now. Just slapping things together in the moment. What is this? Expenditure summary. Executive sector. Q2. Major. Staffing surveillance. Deleted. Data center initiative. Construction. Deleted. Deleted. Minor. Office equipment. Janitorial costs. Deleted. Mold removal. HQ livability costs. For cost breakdown spreadsheet, see page five. For five year comparison chart, see page nine. Oh yeah, I'm gonna read all this great, wonderful, awesome, totally exciting paperwork to you guys. <laughs> this seal. I saw it a long time ago. I keep seeing it in my dreams. Can we see it? Oh, oh no, I, this is a menu. I want to get up close and personal here, lady. I think, here we go, photo mode. This is the seal that she's talking about. Federal Bureau of Control. Oh, 
The photo mode in this game is actually pretty dang cool, guys. Uh, let's just try it out real quick so you can see. Nice uh, glow of the TV on Jesse here with the foreboding hallway in the back. I like that. That's good. We've got to get the logo in there. Federal Bureau of Control. Um, and you know, you can roll the camera. Ugh, I don't like that though. Nope. We can back it up. Really, minutiae? Minutia? Minute controls on here. There's a lot of control in the game control over your photo mode. <laughs> See, that's cool. I wanted that. I wanted to blur out that background. Yeah. And then this goes over to filters. You can throw filters on it. Ooh. Ooh. We'll go with vibrant. That looks cool. And hide player. Nope. Hide other characters. See? Really neat controls for this. Camera speed. What would camera speed affect? Nothing that I can see when I adjust it. Well, anyway, okay, so let's get the UI out of here. Oh, I'm in the picture. <laughs> Federal Bureau of Control. <laughs> can I take your call? <laughs> uh, shit, this is why I hate the freaking face cam because it messes with my photos. Here's what I'm going to do, though. We'll just fix it. Um, I'm just going to crop it later, so maybe just kind of shove everything over into the left-hand side of the photo. And then when I crop myself out, it'll still be like a well-framed photo. This is my hope. This is my dream. We'll see. Yeah. We'll try that out. Spider back, what's up? That's a cat thing. One of my cats always points his pencil sharpener in my face, too. That's what I do. Just throw and go. Nothing special. Mede. Maybe that's why I trip over wires. Yeah, yeah, that's the number one hazard of entertainment industry is wires and cords. Hello, Biter. Late night, Mede. Yeah, hell yeah, late night, Mede. <laughs> It's scary too. It's spooky, guys. All right, cool. So we're let's get out of photo mode here. Excellent. Who's this guy? Tony Stark? What? No, it says head of research, Dr. Casper Darling. Hey, if you see something, say something. This could be a bomb, guys. Who do I tell? Who do I tell this? What does this say? Our bureau at work. That's scary janitor, man. Not that all janitors are scary. But, um... Hey there, look at all that... Yeah, I had to render in there. Director Zachariah Trench. Hmm... He seemed troubled in the last video we saw him in. What's going on in here? Ooh! Creepy bathroom! Hmm? Alright. Oh, thank God. Nothing scary in the bathroom. Bathrooms are scary! Federal Bureau of Control. All these years, I've been looking for them, and they were hiding in plain sight. How do I get in there? Can I duck? No, that's a window. Hmm. I want to go in all these rooms. Let me in. Nope. Nope. Denied. Here we go. Heart Galarak, 12 a.m. here. Late night, it's 5 a.m. here. <laughs> 12 a.m., yeah. It is late. It's like 8.30 my time. So it's not too late, but it's, I knew it would be late for y'all. You don't count Galarak overseas. 
<laughs> USA. At least they flush the toilet. Oh yeah. They do control their pipes with a firm flush. Do you hear that? How is the sound, guys? Can you hear me? Can you hear the music? Ooh, the creepy music. What was that? Federal Bureau of Control. Hello. As you all should know by now, the R4 reports are due by the end of the week. We're still waiting on them from a number of people. If you need an extension, please request from form r4.e from your supervisor. If you think you're exempt from filling filing an R4, then you'll need to get written permission from your department chief saying so. Remember, R4s are mandatory under Section 75.2 of the Employee Manual. If your R4 requires interdepartmental claims, then please contact the appropriate department head, Dr. Darling, Ms. Marshall, Mr. Salvador, or Mr. Kirkland, as needed. They'll be busy on Thursday in their annual policy review, so please schedule accordingly. Best, your admin team. We missed one. Federal Bureau of Control attention all deleted. Blank, 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 blank. A shark in his blank, 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 blank. Although secure, blank, 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 blank. Permission to blank, 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 blank. Following basic protocol, deleted, shoot to kill. Deleted, good luck. This is all very mysterious. Ah! <laughs> Hello? Uh, oh my god, it's Gary Jr. <laughs> oh. Oh. What? Guys, I just went from pure horror to pure delight. <laughs> the Mesh Mesh brought me flowers. Look at this. <laughs> Guys, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Aw, smooches. Sound is good. Okay, good, good, good. Sounds good all the way over here in the UK, but I don't count, apparently. Garak, you totally count. Don't listen to Miterbeck. Miterbeck is just like... Obviously, from his intro and his own videos, he's like, I am Biter Beck. So, you know, nobody matters but Biter. Really. I'm really liking this fruit soda. Oh, this guy is actually a really good singer. Makes him slightly less creepy. I'm a little nervous to talk to him. So I'm arranging all my, um, my gifts here. And then we'll get back to it. Wow, that's so pretty. <laughs> also, or spell well, apparently. Is he mopping or peeing on the floor? Ah, fruit soda. Yeah, we call that wine. I'm, I'll wait. I'll wait. Yeah, thank you. Oh, you guys, Mexican food to boot. To boot. You know what? This guy. This guy just knows how to make a lady feel special. 
Hey, don't force your hetero lifestyle on me. <laughs> oh, jokes. Of course they're jokes. Look, if you didn't notice, I've got Rainbow Unicorn Onesie on. Let me, let me treat you. Do you see what's going on here? <laughs> it, it was cold. I was cold. So I am streaming in my onesie. <sighs> we gotta go talk to this awesome singing guy. Yeah, there wasn't any. <gasps> hey, excuse me. Excuse me. There you are. You are here about the job. Yeah. Janitor's assistant. Janitor's assistant? Interview. Go that way to the elevator. Thanks. Elevator that way. Got it. Very good. I'm Ahti. Janitor, by the way. Ati? Okay. You work for me. You can you say I sent you. If they don't hire you, they tell you are no element. What is he speaking? For the axe. Take them behind the sauna, you hot. Take them behind the sauna? <laughs> We've done enough night shift loner jobs to know it makes us come off weird. Ati the janitor is a friendly face in my oh. book. Better than somebody with She's no face. Got at serious all. empathy for this Think weird janitor. No face. So Jesse's that weird. Said, I like that. I know what you're thinking. If there's an axe murderer around, that's him. Totally. Totally. This is where he keeps the bodies. Alrighty. Can't go in there. He said go down this hallway. Tell them Ati sent you. Alright, creepy elevator opens when you walk by. Oh, we were here before. Just the elevator didn't open again. Or before. Wait. Hold on. Hold. Guys. When we were here last, wasn't this the picture of the janitor? I don't think I caught that when I played this the first time. Ah! I still haven't beat it, guys, just so you know. I still haven't beat it. But, you know, I wanted to, like, get okay at the game before streaming, because you guys can be really judgmental. <laughs> the cell and the poster. I was 11 years old Back the first time I saw poster the metaphor. Poster. They told me I imagined it. I've been trying to pull it down ever since. Will you help? Who are you talking to? Are you talking to me? Who's talking to me? You might be crazy. What's this? Desks, paper clips. Okay. Stopwatch. Federal Bureau of Control. Oh, these are the credits. <laughs> I see. <laughs> I see. Not important at all. Altered object index. What is... Ooh, who's that? Oh, that's that guy. Zachariah. music it's like x-files I'm gonna like read the chat so I don't have to be scared so cool Maddie so sweet to mash yeah he's so sweet Maddie in the jam he's walking down the stairs Going into lurk mode, Matt's promise fire a bit of us time. Oh, yeah, of course, Mia. Thank you for coming by. Yeah. Dimash says, Bahaha, I come into a lifestyle. Did I lose you there well, for a moment? Oh, behave, Mash, you naughty you boy. Know what's on my mind? My baby brother, Dylan. Okay. 17 years since the men of this bureau took him. She's got a brother. Okay. And then he was taken by the federal. Bureau of Control. The FBC. Right? Wow. Ooh, pretty paintings. Now, I've noticed, guys, that there's like, it's like the same two paintings all over the place. It's like they went to Ikea and they had a budget, so they had to get the same three paintings in bulk. Nope. 
can't get in there, huh? No! Alarm! Whoa. How do I get it to turn off? Oh, what's this? Federal Bureau of Control, reminder, regarding drafting any public-facing material while pending any notifications of death related to the Willow AWE, please adhere to the following guidelines, words, phrase to use in the service of his, her country, regret, proud, pride, will be remembered. Words, phrases to avoid, Alaska, scissors, blood, bleed, loss, apologies, sorry. Wow. Uh. I guess there's nothing to be done about this horrible alarm sound. not so bad in other places. Wow, oh, it's so dark. Federal Bureau of Control. Barbara, I'm not to be disturbed. Cancel all my appointments for the day. For the rest of the week, I can't trust them, Barbara. Not a single one of them. Trench. That's the Zachariah fella. Trench. <gasps> Investigate the noise in the director's office. It sounded big and scary. Shit. Ah. Uh. Shit, shit, shit. Whoa. What is that? You Whoa. To pick it up? The murder weapon? Really? Uh, is she talking to fractals? She's talking to fractals. Whoa. <laughs> We're in a big white world! <laughs> and there goes the poster. Whoa! We just got here. Of power can cause or be results of AWE's altered world events, intrusions upon the perceived reality. Now, the service weapon is, of course, a prime example of an OOP, a very powerful one, ingrained in the Bureau's DNA. A key an OOP in our prime over overpowered. Program. Come out of that Russian roulette a winner, and you, <laughs> you're it. You must choose. Oh, look at this place. The chosen one. Where Whoa. Am I? Great question. I love the decor. I feel like I'm in a like gothic 1970s bathroom. All none of the above. These are the concept tattoos we see in your mind. The service weapon. It has many forms, like the house prison you occupy. What the heck is that? Follow the board's instructions. <gasps> ew! Ew! Why does it have long arms? Melee, melee, okay. <laughs> Why does it have long arms? <laughs> uh, what were you doing? The same gun. Ooh! Hello. Okay. Control the gun in the house. Huh. Okay. 
Okay. Now I have a gun. Fire service weapon. Ciao! Alright, cool. Mm -hmm. Destroy the copy's target. Okay. The service weapon regenerates ammunition automatically when not in use. Alrighty, cool. Uh, there's one behind me. Oh, recharging. <laughs> they walk like someone who ate too much. Ah. Oh, more! Oh, they have guns! We wield the gun. You. Oh, the board appoints you. Congratulations, director. Something was coming. This threat. An attack. Duty as director. Keep the bureau safe. Did you hear that? It's the dead man. Right after the pyramid spoke to me, and it was just noise, and I understood every word. And this gun's alive. You know what? I'm happy. Happy to be here. <laughs> All right, interesting. Hey there. Hey, down outside. Is it safe to go? <sighs> wow, blood everywhere. Hang on one sec, guys. The disappearing cat, you guys, can you see her right here? That's Wedge. Moose, that's your nemesis, right here. It's hard to point right there. I can't point right there. <laughs> point right here. That's... That's Wedge. She's not amused. <laughs> Alright, let me see. Let me catch up with you guys. Tom's here. What's up, buddy? Maddie, it's a vampire face, is so wet. Yeah, yeah, when the when there's something bright on the screen, I'm sitting really close, um, so that the camera looks good, but also, like, um, because, like, I feel like I'll be more scared. And I am. I am more scared because I'm closer to the scary things. <laughs> um, overplayed? Never. What are you talking about? Oh, top chat. What did I miss? Overplayed. What are you talking about? Not sure. Anyway, it's okay. Doesn't matter. You be in the Nessus forest. <laughs> Maddie is a vampire. Okay, TV glare. Hey, Damage. Damage. Smash. Lurking in background as this is another of my backlog games. Oh, cool. Got you. Did Godfrey just burp? <laughs> Damage with some vocals there. Same here to Tom. Hi, Tom. Wedge, stay away from the phone, please. <laughs> OP. Oh, gotcha. Gotcha. Um, so we got a gun now. That's pretty cool. I like that. I like that a lot. Oh! <gasps> 
Oh my god! That's <laughs> oh, scary! That's scary! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's just a game. Uh, why is it so scary? terrifying. Those fractal things stopped us from dying. Whew. Whew, they poof away. Poofed. Can I get in here now that I'm the director? Come on. No? So nothing in here. Why is this room so silly? Such a silly room. Nothing in there. Oh, I'm so scared of everything now. These are like the hotline communication. Okay. Oh, that recharge. Ooh. Couldn't come sooner. <gasps> More! Oh, man. Whoa. Whoa. What's up with those guys? They are high. <laughs> Just cleaning the pipes out. <laughs> Streams are better in the dark. It enhances you, I think, make you more prominent. Oh, thanks. I will be streaming in the dark soon. You will see why. Hint, hint. Huh. All right. Interesting. Hmm. Would you like help down? Excuse me, would you? Huh. Federal Bureau of Control confidential for Marshall's eyes only. I am not Marshall, but I will read it. Marshall, we checked out the suspected AWE in Duluth wasn't anything, just like the house fire before this and the malfunctioning clothes dryer before that. My team is getting pretty sick of duds. We need to find better a way to sort of sort the fake AWEs from the real things, or you need to rotate these field agents off the orbit. Anyway, we're en route to Sherman Ranch. Next one on the list. Let's hope it's a little livelier there. Sincerely, Special Agent Keenum. Ooh, we've got other things to look at. What's this? Service weapon. Containment procedure. No unique procedures required. Description 
para utility. The object's form is variable. When bound, the object allows para utilitarians to blank. This object must only be bound by individuals seeking the role of deleted. The object will determine whether deleted deleted. If rejected, the applicant is terminated. This process is dictated by the blank, though their criteria is unknown. Background. The object was discovered inside the oldest house in the room that is now used as the director's office. The popular hypothesis, deleted, many forms throughout history, deleted. Mjolnir, Excalibur, Vernastra, all weapons that deleted of their wielders. If objects of power are the convergence of forces based on the collective subconscious, then this may be the original manifestation of that event. If this is the case, deleted. See Dr. Darling presentation 11.1 for more details. And this is going to hold descriptions of our enemies that we meet. Uh, expenditure summary. I think we looked over that one. Oh, and special picture of Director Trench there, that guy who shot himself. Lovely. And this was. Ooh. Objects of power can cause or be results of AWE's altered world events, intrusions upon the perceived reality. A side note remember to cover their connection to the astral plane as well. Now, the service weapon is, of course, a prime example of an OOP, a very powerful one. So we did see this before. Ooh. Ingrained in the Bureau's DNA, a key component in our prime candidate program. Come out of that Russian roulette a winner and you, <laughs> you're it. Lose and you're well fired. Ah. Thank you. <laughs> I'm Dr. Darling, head of research, Federal Bureau of Control. So, if I understand correctly, when I grab that gun, I, Jesse, grab that gun, we could have died. We could have died if we weren't worthy, so to speak. Anywho, that's wild. And we've got some material assets here. Very Tesla, let's what up? Welcome to the stream, the chat. Late night scary spooky control game. <laughs> that guy drank fizzy lifting drink for sure. You get nothing. I've been enjoying playing control. Creepy, nice action, great story, one of the better free games. Dude, I agree. I actually spent money on this game because I was seeing like the awesome kick ass female main character, you know, and I was like, heck yeah, I gotta play that game. So yeah, uh, I figured since it was one of the free games, anyone who is questioning why they should get a free game <laughs> they'll they'll know that it's pretty awesome thanks for coming by I appreciate it I still haven't finished my first I haven't I, I started the first and I've beat a fair amount of the things and and I did beat the main storyline but there's some side stories I haven't finished and I find myself a little ill-equipped in my I started a new file it deleted the other one you can't have more than one file on this game just word to the wise out there so yeah we committed and deleted everything and I'm gonna take it a little slower uh, and pay more attention to those little they always pop up at inconvenient times but there's these missions that come up and they're like hey go defend this area and um, might be worth doing because I was like needing to level up a little more to get past where I was. All right, bunch of corporate, horrible corporate bureau people jobs here. Ugh, they're just filing paperwork. Those people, they don't get to do anything fun. Like shoot people. Ooh, I see something over here. Executive meeting minutes. Oh, agenda items for next executive meeting. Rising costs of AWE response. Update on mold eradication efforts. Upcoming annual salary review. New supplier of coffee filters to be found and vetted. Please come prepared. Thank you for your time. Those pretty flowers in the middle of that table. Whoa! That's me! Look, that's Jessie! She's got a picture on the wall. <gasps> it's 
so crazy. Oops, just knocking that over. Reminder, if you experience an unanticipated building shift, follow these simple steps. Building shift. One, search the room for any altered items or objects of power. Okay. Two, carry the altered item or object of power to the nearest safe room. Okay. Three, wait for bureau staff to find you and the object. If there are no altered items or objects of power in the vicinity, then reach your supervisor via the nearest intercom and await further instructions. Thank you for your attention. Are these just cigarettes and alcohol lying around here at the office? Nice, guys. We're going to clean up that policy. Put it away. Put it in the cabinet. Keep it secret. Keep it safe. Oh, wait. We went that way. Director's office. Went in there. Do we go in here? Oh, bathroom. Everybody's flushing. Okay, good. <laughs> uh, doo -doo. I'm a little confused. Where am I supposed to go? Oh, here's the other bathroom. Direct oh, probably towards the red, don't you think? <laughs> I don't wanna. Oh. Look, it's her again. What the heck? How'd they get my picture so fast? Can we go in here yet? No. We can't go in there yet. What can I do? Alright, we went the wrong way, obviously. But where have we not been that we can go? This way, we went in there. Oh, this way. <gasps> Central Executive. The hissing sound that tried to invade me earlier. The hiss burrowing into everything in this place. Is the hiss your enemy? All right, it's our enemy. That babble's contagious. It burns in like an infuriating melody that makes you hum it over and over. <laughs> Alright, some interesting music we got for this area. Urban Legends. Summary. Examination of paranatural topics. Summary. Urban legends are believed to affect the creation of altered materials, but can also dictate the characteristics of an altered world event. Urban legends are understood as the modern evolution of Jung's archetypes. We recognize certain deleted, informed by our own deleted, and popularized by our media. We have additionally proven that urban legends can even be artificially deleted in popular culture using deleted. Our bureau made anthology television program. Once the seeds are sown, human imagination exacerbates the details. Certain paranatural phenomena contain clear elements of popularized folklore, AWEs, that only occur on deleted. A pair of scissors that consume human deleted through two punctures on the deleted. These details, living in the minds of so many, have been given strength through belief. Urban legends are not just stories for children, they are paranatural realities waiting to happen. Refer to the file 4-93-6942 for a full report. Alright.
Federal Bureau of Control how to handle unscheduled visitors entering the lobby. Start with the following. Welcome to the Federal Bureau of Control, established in 1964 as part of an effort to strengthen government relations. We are proud to serve the United States and our people as we strive for transparency and excellence in all aspects of our esteemed nation's infrastructure. If they do not leave, then ask them these questions. Are you here to see someone? Are you from New York City or just visiting? How did you find this place? If their answers are sufficiently harmless, explain that this is a secure federal office and that they'll need to leave. If their answers seem deleted, escort them to a private room. There, perform the gunner's psychological assessment. If their responses are within the acceptable range of deviance, see the provided scoring sheet, then delete it immediately. Remember, there's no such thing as too suspicious. Just jump down here. <gasps> oh my god! They're shooting at me. Oh, it's gotta recharge again. large health bar. Uh. Oh! Oh! We died! I needed to run by some of that health. <laughs> the hiss! The hiss! Ah, it's all around me! Yeah, you pay attention to your health bar during combat. This game actually, the advice it gives tends to be sort of targeted. Like if you die of a certain thing, it's like, why don't you try this? Sound that tried to invade me earlier. The hiss burrowing into everything. In this All right, place. we're gonna go for him first. Guy. All right, it's our. Oh. Oh my gosh. Holy crap. Ugh, they're hard to see. So everything is red. They're red. It's all red around. Okay, we got the big big guy with the big gun. That's not who's talking. Nope. Here we go. Our fractal friend helps us. Please, talk to me. I can't tell you how happy I am to talk to somebody sane. The feeling's mutual. I'm Pope, Emily Pope, Dr. Darling's assistant. My turn. Should I lie? Jesse Faden. I'm just visiting. 
I should have lied. Oh shit! You're the new director. Hold on, we're coming out. Director, Faden. Call me Jesse. Okay, Jesse. I'm Emily. Look, somehow this hostile force, this hiss, that works. Somehow the hiss managed to infiltrate the building without any warning. And just like that, my name for it is official. The hiss. Like the sound of poison gas leaking in. We're in full lockdown. It seems to have spread everywhere and to everyone not protected by an HRA. And, extraordinarily, you. You are the director, and that makes you special by definition. Trench is no longer the director, obviously. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm talking too much. This whole situation is just a lot. Shot. Ah, I found his body. And the gun. Do I tell her it looked like a suicide? The service weapon. Also, and this can sound crazy, but he keeps appearing to me, saying things. It's hard to make out, but he told me to cleanse the control point, push the hiss out. The whole room shifted around. You did that? And Hi, Vanilla. Good morning. I was already in the lockdown before morning. you became the new director. How? I'm not ready to tell her about you yet. A janitor let me in. No. <laughs> I love it. This is fucking unbelievable. It's. I can't even. Uh, look, Jesse, I have a million questions, and you probably have a million more. Like, do you know my brother Dylan? Not yet. But there's something I need to ask you to do first. If you can cleanse a control point, then you can maybe cure those infected or possessed by the hiss. Because if that's possible, our options are very different. Emily Pope. I don't know her, but I like her already. She's the opposite of the faceless agency I've blamed for what happened to me for so long. But I can't trust her yet. Or rather, the Bureau she's a part of. Yes. I can try. I'm speaking for you, of course. We can try it together. So I do really like the story of this game. The cinematic okay. quality of you the with scenes. Me? We did it before. Um, Push the you know, hiss out. The graphics are pretty good. like, And I like the voice actors, too. So far, so good anyway. Alright, we're gonna try to cure this lady. Uh-oh. Ooh! Deceased. It didn't work. The hiss has burrowed too deep. Ripping it out rips them apart. Mm, yeah, not so good. Jesse, over here. We need to make a plan, Jesse. Where? Where'd you go? There you are. I can't cleanse them. I saw. It was worth a shot. Thank you, Director. Jesse. I'm gonna tell her why I'm here. I'll risk it. Listen, the Bureau was involved in an incident in my hometown, Ordinary, 17 years ago. The Bureau came in and covered the whole thing up. I've been looking for this place for a long time. That's enough. Maybe that's too much already. I can't tell her about Dylan and the rest yet. I've seen mentions of an altered world event case dealing with Ordinary. You're at ground zero as a child? I 
It was one of the big ones, and before my time. And very classified. I can try to dig out some old files for you. My boss, Casper Darling, would know, but he's missing. I think he knew this was coming, or suspected. He came up with the HRAs, the Hedron Resonance Amplifiers. I think they're what saved us. A few of us. And Director Trench would know. Trench? The ghost, or whatever he is. He mentioned something called the hotline. Said I should find it. It's another object of power, like the gun. An old Bakelite telephone? A direct line of communication between the director and the board. Maybe he can talk to you more clearly through that. I mean, Trench has years and years of experience. He might know how to destroy the hiss. Where is the hotline? It's kept in the communications department through the mailroom. It's part of this sector, so we can access it even with the lockdown in place. We'll get the door open for you. Okay, that's my next stop. That's Tomasi's department. He's the head of communications. I don't think he had an HRA. He kind of made a point about not wearing one earlier. Keep an eye out. They okay. call me the director. But that's not me. I'm not a director type. I'm not a leader. Why am I here? I think you already know. Yes, I came for my brother, but there are other reasons too. I said I was looking for answers, but I might never understand them. I'm not looking for proof. This is already it. More than enough. No matter what they told me all those years, I know it's real now. I didn't imagine this. I want to be a part of this world. What scares me shitless is that I finally found it. Only to see the hiss destroy it all. Hello? <laughs> Ooh, welcome to I the oldest house. You, so don't hesitate to ask me anything you want to know. There are no stupid questions. Beautiful. The door to the comms department is just outside the boardroom back in the lobby. They should have gotten it open by now. Follow the signs to the mail room. You can get to the hotline containment chamber through there. Good luck, Jesse. See you back here once you have the hotline. Thanks, Pope. Thanks, Emily. All right, you guys. This has been awesome. We started the game. Control. We did this first kind of chapter. Sweet. Welcome to the oldest house section. We're going to end the stream there. Thank you for coming along and joining me. Keeping me not, um, you know, too scared. You know, the fact that your hair helps. So I appreciate that a lot. Um, yeah. And we'll do this again sometime soon. Um, I'll have a schedule coming out for my discord soon i'm just fiddling around with where the schedule's gonna kind of lie and what's going on with all that so stay tuned for sure what is say friday saturday tomorrow i don't know uh but sunday i hop on with banana tom we'll be streaming d2 doing a raid i think uh that's 2 p.m P P pst on Sunday and then Monday I think I'm gonna pop in some Horizon Zero Dawn again what yeah Tuesday full of action 11 a.m. for me hopping on with Scottish Rod and Banana Tom and Dimash Smash in NMS exploring having fun you know and then after that Tomb Raider Tuesday at 2 so exciting we started this third one just this last uh, last Tuesday um, so get caught up with us on that 
And then Wednesday, RDO, you know, the Posse Roundup. It's always happening. This Wednesday happens to be my birthday. So we're going to have extra fun. And I hope you're there. So don't miss it. I'll catch you guys on all the streams, including those later on. Take care now. Uh, let me just see who hopped in here. Boss Jillian, thanks for coming by. Travis, you guys, so sweet of you to just, just drop in. Hit the like if you would while you're here, you know, if you want to. Uh, hey, hey, how's it going? Just waking up from a small unexpected nap over here. Oh, those, those are interesting because you think they might be 20 minutes and then they're like three hours. <laughs> Morning, Travis. Well, yo, Dimash, Dimash, good evening. Heck yes, great stream, man. Thank you, Dimash. Later. Later. Great stream. Thank you, boss. Dimash, hit me up sometime and we can fit that new normal save. Fix that new normal save. Heck yeah. See you soon, Robo. See you. Take care, everybody. Veritas, everyone who stopped by. Vanilla, Galarak, have a great day. I know you guys just woke up and all that, so enjoy it. Moose. Moose and um, who else is my buddies who were kind of lurking? Tom is lurking. You guys are awesome for coming by. Meow meow. I hope you're having a nice night with Firestorm. She's not even paying attention. I'm glad because, you know, that's some good self care. You gotta take care of your, your boo. And Tamash, thanks for the flowers. You know, I'm setting a good example for folks. This one was like two hours long. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, we did a nice solid two. Um, I like to do a nice solid two when I can. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Ooh. TTFN. <laughs>